the way that you act has a big influence on a woman's attraction to you, right? So let's say a woman meets you and she's like, oh, you know, he seems kind of cool or whatever, but she's not like, you know, head over heels about you, but she's like, oh, you know, he's cute, whatever it is like that, right? Now, based off of the way you act is going to tell her what type of guy you are because women have a, a, they have to have a filtering system when they're dealing with men. And a lot of guys don't know this. So what happens is because women get bombarded with a lot of guys, they have to get, have a, they have like a subconscious filtering system to determine what type of guy you are. So if you're the type of guy that says, Hey, I'll be your friend and, and we'll, I'll be in the friend zone and blah, 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 and all this other stuff. What that's telling her is, is that you're not an attractive guy. Why? Because an attractive guy wouldn't be like just settling for a woman's friend to be a woman's friend. An attractive guy would be too busy out here dating, hooking up and having a good time with women. Right? So what happens is that if that guy is trying to talk to that girl and she's like, Oh, we could be friends. He was like, nah, 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 listen, listen, I'm not trying to do that friend stuff, but listen, here's my number. When you change your mind about getting together, hit me up. And then he just walks away. She's going to be more attracted to that guy than a guy that's like, okay, I'll be your friend. Because that first guy that's like, here's my number. And he walks away. She's like, man, he must, you know, actually have women. And he must be like a, 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 a interesting dude. If he's just going to walk away from me this way, because that's get, that's telling her something about him that he has the confidence to walk away. He's going to go get with other girls and she's going to miss out. That's what she starts to think. So sometimes what happens is she changes her mind and be like, okay, let me call him and see what, what he's about. Right. So your actions are always going to tell women what type of guys you are, because remember, also, sometimes these women have given guys chances who were, let's say, guys who are kind of needy, you know what I mean? And, and kind of weird. And so what happened is, let's say she gave a guy her number and then he texted her and she, she didn't respond because she was like in class or something or she was like working or whatever. And then he texts her again. And he's like, hey, what's up? And he texts her a third time and she said and respond. He's like, yo, why the F you ain't hit me back? And why are you acting like... So she's like, yo, this guy's crazy. Like, why is he stalking me? And she got to block him and do all this other stuff. So what happens is that when she runs into another guy that reminds her of him, of that guy, if she runs into another needy guy, another weird, clingy type of dude, she's going to automatically reject him. Because that guy reminds her of all the other goofy guys that would do that type of stuff. But if a guy's chill, calm, cool, collected, confident, he reminds her of all the other cool, calm, collected, confident guys that she actually liked it. She liked. So this is why I tell guys your behavior is going to give a woman an indication of what type of guy you are. And then usually she'll make a decision in most cases based over that. And a lot of times it's, it's subconscious. For example, I'll give you another example too that a lot of guys don't know. This is why I say you got to work on your appearance, you know, your look, sh get a shape up, you know, shave your hair, whatever it is like that. Do you know that women, I tell guys this all the time, women are more receptive to you approaching them and talking to them based off of your appearance. So if you have like nice clothes on, your hair is cut, your teeth is white, you're smelling good or whatever, and you go up to a woman and you say, hey, how you doing, miss? Most of the time she will talk to you just off of your appearance. Now, the reason why women do that is because women judge themselves based off of the type of men that approach them. You see what I'm saying? So now the reverse. Now, let's do the reverse. Let's say a guy is walking up to the girl. He has like ripped, you know, like his jeans look all dirty. His, his shoes is messed up. He's smelling like kind of musty. He's like, yo, girl, how you doing? She gonna look at him like and then, and then what happened is this is why girls act like bitches sometimes to certain guys because she's offended that you would even approach her. She's like, what would make this dusty dude think he could talk to you? You understand what I'm saying? Because then it reflects bad on her. She's like, what is it about me? Am I, you know, that makes this guy feel he can approach. But when you're on point and when your appearance is tight, she's happy you approached because it makes her feel good about herself. She's like, look at the type of guy I can get to approach me. And then she's more receptive. This is why I say that it's important to work on your appearance and everything else because it makes the women way more receptive to you because she's like, oh, I can actually attract guys like this versus those other bums. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's, that's what happens. You know what I mean? Now, before you go, click the link below and go to badboymembership.com. Now, badboymembership.com is a place where you go to get 45 through 90 minute audio and video dating advice tutorials every month. Listen, I know you're tired of being rejected Go to badboymembership.com. I know you're tired of being afraid to approach women. Go to badboymembership.com. 
I know you're tired of not getting the women that you want. Go to badboymembership.com. Listen, I know you're tired of being alone on a Friday night. Go to badboymembership.com. Now picture this. You'll go from not getting what you want when it comes to you dealing with women to actually getting what you want, to being the guy women want to be with, women want to date, women want to have sex with. All you need to do is go to badboymembership.com, follow the steps, learn the game, implement the game, and then you will get the woman you want. Make sure you go to badboymembership.com today. Click the link below. Click the link below or go straight to MrLocario.com to get the documentary Game Kings, The Definition of Game.